Hey guys, welcome back to Mystic Mo. This is your girl Mo. And I have showing you all my business. <laughs> and I have a message for you today. Today's message <clears throat> is about the tea that is happening for you this week. So your tea is there's somebody trying to threaten you or you could be threatening somebody else because of your presence and your aura. Um, this person is a happiness hater. They're hating on the love, the newfound happiness, the joy, the inner peace that you have within yourself. And realizing that you are no longer working towards pleasing others around you you're looking for what's best for you you also have spiritual hater here so somebody's hating on your spiritual practices or dislikes um the way you handle certain things spiritually um this could be something somebody that is strongly connected to religion but also you have bad karma and bad habits that were placed together and then moving on right underneath that next to the spiritual hater. So you could be moving on from certain things that provide you something that doesn't feel right for your soul. Whether it's bad habits, um, bad situations that you've learned the lesson to. And you're using your spiritualness, your spirituality to move forward and this person is not liking it. But you have a moving and moving on here so you are going to the next but you're also uh moving to something else you're moving somewhere else this could be because where you're living now people could be sending you uh death threats or um threatening you with hate mail or whatever so you could be moving because your current location is too exposed uh this could be a stalker um a love on the brain so somebody that you feel very connected to um romantically could be coming in with an offer you could be dusting off old habits um this person is boss daddy energy okay he's very stable has his own business is CEO. Somebody could be over here trying to kiss up to you, suck up to you. Um, there could be some kind of romantic love affair. You could be holding a grudge because somebody had you in a third party relationship and you're not that kind of person. So if you were made aware of it, you wouldn't even have bothered going down that route. Um, And so you're holding a grudge with this person. You continue shedding your light regardless of what other people think. There could be some kind of scarcity tactics that, or this person could be threatening you with scarcity tactics to get you to do what it is that you, that they desire. Showed you all my business again. Anyways, I'm about to get to those dishes here in a minute. But that has been your reading. Peace and love. Don't forget to like this video. Share it with somebody else. And subscribe if you want to see more. Many blessings. Ta-ta.